and let's jump into it. Okay, team, time for a hit session. Let's do a quick little warm up. So we're gonna start on our hands and knees. Keep your back nice and flat, hips nice and steady. We're gonna do some hip circles, drawing it with our knee. Coming up the back and out to the side. So just warming up our hips here. And then go the opposite direction with that same leg. Beautiful. And then we'll swap sides for those hip circles up to the other side. Really keep your hips nice and steady as you do this. We want to keep our hips like train tracks to the floor. And change direction. Beautiful. All right, and then next we're gonna do a bird dog. So get your back nice and flat with our opposite arm to leg, we're gonna extend forwards, come back in the center and then the other side. So your goal here is to keep your back nice and flat belly button up towards the sky and we're staying nice and stable here. Beautiful. Two and one. Awesome. And then we're going to set up in a nice deep squat position, whatever that looks like for you. Pop your elbows inside your knees and just kind of shift side to side so you're opening up those hips. <clears throat> and then we're going to reach towards your wrist, hips in the air and feel that big stretch down the back of your thighs. And then come back down. Grab the hip up. Then back into that deep squat. Good job. And down. Awesome. And then slowly standing up, we'll go into some nice big arm circles towards the back. Big arm circles. And then to the front. Awesome. All righty. So today we are going to be doing a couple of different blocks. We're going to start off with a Tabata block, which is 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Um, and we've got two exercises that we're going to do for this one. So our first exercise is a forward lunge. If you have weights, you can add this into it. Um, otherwise, body weight is great. Stepping forwards, dropping your back knee down, and then onto the other side. Then exercise two, we're going to drop down into a plank position. Mountain climbers, running our knees into our chest. All right, so 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. I'll just get our timer set up. All righty. So forward lunge and mountain climbers. Starting in three, two, and one. Stepping forward for that lunge, dropping the back knee down. Beautiful, 20 seconds here. Try and go as quick as you can, as deep as you can. Beautiful, and time. All right, mountain climbers in three, two, and one. Knees into the chest, keep your shoulders over your hands, hips down. 
Belly button in. Beautiful. Keep it up. And time. Awesome. We've got three more rounds back. So lunges in three, two, and one. Stepping forwards, drop the back knee down. Awesome. Big push off. And time. Nice. All right, mountain climbers in three, two, and one. Push the floor away. Draw that belly button in. Nice team. Keep your shoulders over hands, hips down. And at time. Nice. Two hands down. We're going to do two more of this. All right, three, two, and one. Lunges. Tomato goes nice and fast. Good. Really drop that back knee down. Big push off. And time. Nice. Right, mountain climbers, three, two, and one. Run those knees in, keep your body nice and steady. Good stuff, team. And time, awesome. All right, one more round of this. Let's go into your lunges. Straight into it, guys. Nice. Keep dropping that back knee down. And time. All right. Last time for mountain climbers. Three, two, and one. Let's do it. Keep pressing the floor away. Tuck your hips under. And time. Whew. Beautiful. All right, team. Good job. That was a great little set to warm us up. We are going to move on. So next up, we're going to be doing an EMOM. So EMOM stands for every minute on the minute. We've got three exercises and you want to complete that within your minute. Um, and then the rest of the minute is your rest time. So the idea is to go as quick as you can. So our three exercises, we're going to be doing five walkouts. So hands to the floor, walk to your plank position, and then let's push yourself back up. So we're going to do five reps of that, followed by six switch squats. So standing in the squat position, we're going to step forward, deep squat, back, deep squat, forward. So you're going to do that six times. The idea is to go nice and fast. And then we're going to move into five explodes. So little squat jumps, landing in your squat position. You can't jump for any impact reasons. You can just do 10 squat pulses in the stead there. Alrighty. So every minute on the minute. So every time a new minute starts, we go again. All right, let's do it. Starting in three, two, and one. Five walkouts. And then we go into six switch squats. 
followed by eight squat jumps. Beautiful. Good. We're 20 seconds into the minute. So six switch squats. Good, just going as fast as you can. Nice, into eight explodes. Ooh, all right, we've got 15 seconds to rest. Good job, team. All right, five seconds and we start again. Three, two, and one. Walk out. Beautiful. Nice, go as quick as you can. And then into your switch squat. Nice, getting as low as you can. And then eight squat jumps. Hello, legs. Nice team. All right, 10 seconds, and we're going to go back into it. Round three. Whew. Three, two, and one. Walk out. Five, walk out. Picking up the pace as much as we can. Nice. Six switch slots. Nice. And a squat jump. Woo, they're feeling good. Oh, nice. Definitely feel that burn. Good job, team. You are killing it. All right, five seconds. It's our last round. Two and one. Let's go. Nice, team. So good. Last round here. Oh man. Good job, keep pushing it. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, good job team. Definitely double legs. Amazing. All right. We've got one last little block that we're going to move through. It's a little ab and cardio block. We're going to be doing 30 seconds of work for both of these exercises. And then we'll have a little bit of recovery after it. And then we're going to do four rounds. So our first exercise is a V leg extension. So you're going to put your hands behind you, lift your feet up, and then we're going to slowly lower one leg at a time. If you wanted to make this more challenging, you can take your hands off the floor. That's up to you. All right, so there's exercise two. We're going to come into a plank position. We're going to jump forward, bend the knees, keep the hips down, and it jumps back. So those are our snap jumps. You can do a step inverted if jumping is too much for you. And then step back out. <clears throat> All right, let's jump into it. So 30 seconds, <clears throat> excuse me, each exercise with a little bit of recovery afterwards. All right, let's set up. So 
body in three, two, and one. Let's go. Leg extensions, nice and controlled. Awesome. You can also do this lying on your back if it's a little bit challenging. Nice, good control. Two. And one. All right, roll over into the snap jumps. Go straight into it. 30 seconds. Nice. Got it, 10 seconds. Time. All right, it's a little bit of rest. Whew. All right, starting in three, two, and one. Leg extensions. Whew. Legs are feeling heavy. You got it, team. Really keep your pelvis tucked under your ribs, pressing down. Nice. 10 seconds here. And time straight into those snap jumps. Let's go. Nice. Keep that core nice and tight. Shoulders over arms. So close. And time. Awesome. All right, we're gonna do one more round and then we are done. Three, two, and one. Let's go. Leg extensions. Keep those roots pressing down. Awesome. 10 seconds, team. Let's keep it pushing. Got it. And time. All right, snap jump straight in. Beautiful. Finish off strong, guys. Bend your knees as you land. 10 seconds here. Woo. And time. Woo. Good stuff, team. That was a sweaty one. All right, let's do a quick little stretch out. Come into a nice wide leg child pose. Reach your hands forward. Really let your chest fall towards the floor. Breathe in and out through the nose. And then take one arm, slide it through your armpit. So you go into this little twist. And then over to the opposite side. Beautiful. Bring your feet into a nice little 99 degree position. Tuck your outside foot in nice and close and lean back to your nice uh, hip and quad stretch. Awesome, swap side. Just leaning back as far as you are able to. Awesome. 
Awesome. And then stretch your legs out in front of you. Bend your knees as much as you need to. And just we'll reach towards those toes for a big lower back stretch. Stretch through the back of the legs. Awesome. All right, we are finished for today. Thanks so much for joining me guys on Zoom and on Instagram. I'm sweaty. Hope you guys are too. I'll catch you next time. How'd we go team?